Well, folks, we're getting rigged up right here. We're we're out here in the bone docks. I don't even know if you can. Uh, Rocky, I don't even think there's no GPS coordinates for this area, are they? <laughs> All right, folks, we're here at a little bitty creek or a little branch, whatever you want to call it. It's called Crawfish Branch. We're going to catch you some live crawfish. The best, or one of the best baits for smallmouth bass. Catching quite a few here, folks. Having to really work for them, but that is the sport of fishing. Let me show y'all what I got so far. Can y'all see in there? We're ganging up a few, and I got a bonus helgramite, too. Which, when I grabbed a hold of him, he grabbed a hold of me. Them things can pinch. Right here looks like a good place. Let's try this. There's one. See there? I'm getting to develop a pattern on which rocks to, to catch a lot of fish. If you'll look down through there, see the rocks that's exposed? Those are the ones that's holding the crawfish. <laughs> he won't let it go up my knee yet. Look. Damn it. There's one right there, folks. Yep. He ain't very big, but they don't have to be. For smallmouth, you don't really have to have a big crawfish. And all I'm doing is lifting this rock, these rocks up, holding my net like that, and hoping one is under that rock. He'll swim into the net. There's a little bitty one. Look here, folks. How little that crawfish is. Can y'all see that? That's too little. <laughs> All right, folks. Let's go ahead and hook us a crawl dog up. Now, this is a size 4 eagle claw bait holder hook. Now, I'm going to take him, and I'm just going to hook him right here in the tail. Like that. And that's it. That's how I'm going to fish them. There's about three or four different ways you can hook them. This is six pound test floor carbon with eight pound test braid. And I have a leader here around six feet. And I have them joined up with a double uni knot. <laughs> what happened to you, Rocky? I reached in there to get a crawdash. Yeah. I got a helgamite in there. And that thing grabbed a hook into my phone. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you something. Don't think anybody's can't <laughs> They'll hurt you bad, won't they? Yeah, that, that ain't got a hole to it. Oh, man. Let's see if we can catch one right here. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna throw one at the edge of them rocks right there. Let it sink down there slow, I think. I think that's probably a pretty good place. Maybe. Yep, he's got it. There we go, there's a smile mouth. That's a good one. <laughs> it is, ain't it? <laughs> Ooh, look what a beautiful smallmouth. That's a beautiful creek smallmouth. Now, we've done a lot of walking. We have. We walked what, probably a mile and a half. <laughs> probably a mile and a half. But now, me and Rocky grew up like this. We did. We grew up outside. And we knew sooner or later we'd find them. There you go. And I believe we did. Yeah. Okay. That's a nice small jaw. Nice small I'm just going to let him wear out. You oh. talking about pulling, folks. Look at that thing. This fish is pulling. I get excited about small mouth. I, I do, too. They're, they're, wait. they're special fish. They are a special fish. Look at that. Look at there. Look at there. Look at there. Look how f girthy that fish Ooh, is. What, 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 maybe two pounds? Maybe. He's a, he, just a he's a chunk. Let me throw out there before you turn him back. Well, I'm going to turn him back so he'll go that way. He'll just follow this right here, folks, and go to the next pole. All right. <laughs> Let's let him go. Uh-huh. Look at there. They. I'm talking about they. We fixing to catch them, Rocky. I hope so. We deserve it after that walk. I'm, I'm Woo! Now, here's a bigger crawfish, yeah, folks. I was saving him for this occasion. Let's just hook him right there. 
There he is, Richard. Look here. Watch this. Got him. Got him. Is it a good one? Pretty good. <laughs> Pretty good. One. There ain't nothing wrong with that. It's a oh, channel it's cat. Spot. No, this is no, it's a spotted bass. Really not a spot. Look at there. Well, I don't care if they're spots or small care. mouth. Or large mouth. He's pulling. He's pulling. pulling drag. Look at it. Look at there. We fishing with like, I'm fishing with like six pound test lines. Yeah, me too. Uh, I've got my drag set. It's a lot sportier, ain't it? In these creeks. But now that's a good spotty bass. Good creek spot right there. Uh, anywhere, even in a lake, that's yeah. a good good fish. Right Look how fat that fish is, folks. And right in the roof of the mouth there where you're supposed to. They. Look at that. Look at there. Look I at think, there. I think we found some fish right here. We got some. And I believe ahead of this hole yeah. might be a good place, well, too. Yeah, that's, a, that's the deepest part of it. It's just a little secondary coming off of it there. <laughs> anyway, there you go. All right. I appreciate it, sister. Yeah. I'm going to try it one more time right here. Let's, let's throw one more in here. We'll move on up there where Rocky is here in just a minute. I got a feeling that could be another fish or two right here. Yep, there he is. Y'all ready? There we go. Oh, my, my, my. Got us a bass. I don't know. Oh, that's a nice bass, too. Yeah. For a creek, you cannot beat this. I think it's a spotted bass. He's not really fighting like a. Yep. <laughs> Look at there. They love crawdads. Now this is a smallmouth. I thought it would look like smallmouth. It is smallmouth. Yes, sir. They have got the power. Folks. That is. Let's flip him up here. Oh yeah, look at that. You ever notice on these small mouths when they got this little white? Always I have this little white dot right here on the back of their head. Yeah. Always. And their tails are so much broader than a spot. They, yeah, they're not rounded like a large mouth. No. See right here they're more uh see how they come out to a point? Uh -huh. That's where they get their power. Yep. See a, a large mouth would be rounded on the end right there. They're, I tell you, they're a special fish. Especially in these creeks. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Look at them lateral lines on them. Yeah, he is pretty. Yeah, them, them lines are running vertical. They are. All the way down. Let's let him go. Go on back in there, boy. Golly, he took off like a rocket. All right, folks. Let's put this in right here. I still believe there's another bass right here. <clears throat> the reason is is because they're hitting quick. Yeah, I can feel it. There's a big fish in here. It's got that feel about it. Ain't it does. There he is, too. He knocked a fire out of that, folks. He's got it, man. He's got it. He's got it. But it ain't what I thought it was. Oh, me. They are. Look here. We could have a mess of these to eat if we wanted to. I'm going to save my crawfish. He's tough enough to catch another another fish. But look at there, folks. I ain't nothing like it. There he is. There he is. Now, that's a bass. I don't know. No. Well, we got a double right here. They better be glad we ain't fishing for food. You t this thing is full of these yeah. right here. Look at that. That's the same size. Now, yeah. if we was hungry, we'd eat them. Mm -hmm. I don't know how much bigger they get. but They get a little bigger. Quite a bit bigger, really. Yeah. Look at that. There you go. Let's let them go. Good deal. Man. They... Are they biting? They're biting. And I tell you, when you don't... If y'all look out there, there's very little current... Now, me, I'd rather not even have a split shot on. But everybody's different. I just want a hook, and that's it. Because a crawfish's natural instinct is to dart up under a rock. 
They'll do it every time. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's a good one, ain't it? Too bad. He's too little guy. That's mama. He's yep. A little small man. Looks like. Pull them things apart. Look at it. Yep. Look at the line. They, <laughs> they don't. don't know what to do, they don't know when to quit. No, they don't. That ain't bad. Uh-uh, it ain't bad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yep. They don't waste any time. If they're there, they'll pick that crawfish yeah, they, they up. They don't play with it. No, look how dark that one is. Yep. Yeah, like land up on one of them big rocks over there in the shade. Seen that crawfish hit and just eat. Run out there and got it. Yep. They recognize what a crawfish looks like. Oh, yeah. I'm going to say that's probably the number one bait for, for small mouth. So. They love them. Hey, man, I'm talking about Bursal. He's had the gas for three weeks. There he goes, folks. Ooh, look at it. Got him. Oh, that's a small mouth. Little small mouth, but it's a small mouth. Well, now this one hole. Yep. Golly, it's amazing. Even a little bitty one like that has a lot of power. Come on back here, boy. You got another one? I got some. That's a rock bass. Golly. <laughs> now that's a man right there. Oh, man. Look at there, folks. Small mouth and a rock bass. I mean, like right out there together. Yeah. And this hole really ain't big. Ain't much to it. There's not much to it, but it's pretty deep. Yeah. It's got a lot of fish in it. Let's let him go, folks. Shot off like a rocket. They always swallow them tail first. Yeah. Pretty little fish. Oh, man. I tell you what. Bursal and Tarval won't do stuff like this. They allow that they're too old. Well, I don't believe in that age deal. I guarantee you that. I'm going to go to my toes turn up. Then I won't have no other choice. I'm going to tell you what. It's a blessing to be able to do stuff like that. And Rocky... Thank you a lot for oh. showing me that creek. Hey, we're going to do that again. We're going to do it again, folks. We're going to come back a little later on, and we're going to beat that catch. Yep. Here in the great state of Tennessee, I want to say thank you all for everything you all do, all the great comments. God bless each and every one of you all. And, golly. Come on, my goodness. Woo! And to remember... Go fishing when you can, but call this good furry.